How about this show? Wow, Pismo Beach looking very good today. Some extra folks out and about on this holiday for some. And uh, yeah, the weather did not disappoint today. A lot of 70s for daytime highs. Let's take a look at the forecast outlook moving forward. Offshore flow is going to pick up, so that's going to mean mild temperatures all of this week. Now there is a rain chance as early as Friday into Saturday, but it's a better chance for Southern California, and I'll explain why coming up. Be on KSPY pictures today again, just a few high clouds. Wow, lake looking very good. Donna, very good view there. And Linda Midkiff up in Paso Robles, some contrails and some high clouds as well. Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram for your pictures. Show us what you're up to. Again, just a few high clouds coasting over the area right now. The overall pattern is actually pretty complex. We have three different branches of the jet stream. The issue is none of them are carrying any storm systems directly our way. We do have a little weakness here in the ridge. This is going to push through Nevada, and as it does so, high pressure builds in behind that, cranking up the offshore flow a bit over the next couple of days, especially in Southern California. But locally tonight, across the Santa Inez Mountains, some of the wind gusts could exceed 20 miles per hour. There's no advisory yet, but if you're heading through the passes and canyons, of the south coast tonight into early tomorrow. You can see that four to six footers out there from the buoys 66 in Bakersfield and Sacramento 64 in San Francisco 61 LA and 63 in San Diego a little closer to home 62 in San Luis and Santa Maria 66 Santa Barbara 59 in Vandenberg. Not surprisingly, it's an onshore flow. That's why Vandenberg is cooler than the rest of the area with the stronger wind speed now. Take a look at tomorrow in Lompoc. Our hourly forecast gets us back up to nearly 70 degrees by 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Morning offshore flow, not particularly strong. The return flow is actually stronger in the afternoon. In Pismo Beach, you're looking at a start near 50 degrees. We're back up into the mid 60s as early as noon through 3 o'clock. Really nice day to be out and about near the beach in Pismo tomorrow. Tascadero, North County, no slouch. Starting kind of cool in the 30s, but we're up into the 60s by the time we get to noon and by 3 o'clock in the afternoon. Downtown looks pretty good in Atascadero. Morro Bay back into the lower 60s with offshore early flow turning around. Again, this is the, I guess I'd call it a headline in quotes because we've been waiting for rain opportunities for so long. By the time we get into early Thursday, you can see this large trough carving out here off the coast. The area of low pressure is going to try to spin up. Here's the problem. When you have an entire week where offshore flow will be a dominant factor, when this low gets to California, it runs into that dry air mass. So the dynamics of lift are there, but the supply of moisture looks pretty meager. Could we see a splash maybe here and there? Yeah, but a better chance over Southern California likely. And then after that, pretty quiet all the way through the following week. You get the idea here. We need more rain opportunities than that. It is odd to see this month, this month of February, be this quiet. 71, Santa Maria and Santa Barbara. 72 in San Luis, 71 for Paso. Again, the interior valley is cool, but probably missing a freeze tonight. Santa Inez Valley temperatures lower 40s, but warming back up into the low 70s tomorrow. In the five cities, the beaches in the upper 60s to nearly 70 degrees. Again, these are incredible numbers for this time of year. Extended forecast, we might cool just a little bit as we get into midweek, but all these numbers are average or slightly above average, depending on the town. Is it going to be a splash and dash Friday in San Luis Obispo if it rains at all? Might be enough to get those windshields wet, not enough to help us with our growing dryness and drought for part of California.